Hello and Ignite, welcome back to the, the pretty much this, almost the end of Balance Work 1. So, a final trial for getting 174 out of 175 battle chips is we at Fight Base. Now, I'm going to give you a fair one because this is post commentary. I did use a cheat, a cheat code just to be able to find him. And I. Like, he is legally found up, findable, but... And I do really suck at fighting them, because this was my first ever time fighting them. <laughs> yeah. I just didn't end up grinding everything in death. I kept to save. But yes. It's an interesting fight at that. Eight, about 8 minutes long, and he's got an aura of 100, which is annoying. Now, thankfully, his attacks are kind of simple to figure out. It's just... Yeah, I never knew how to do this before. And so I was kind of sucking. But the red ones are kind of like Woodman's Wood Towers. And it's like, yeah, I'm not missing the first hit. Because his life aura does regenerate. When he charges through, it's kind of like a chasing shot, doing like a squealy pattern. The red one, yeah, like it's, it's Woodman's Wood Tower, a uh, multi Wood Tower thing. And I walked into that. He does a lot of damage. I have to say that. And I do really save state abuse here. This, I promise, is going to be probably the only time I will ever say state abuse this much in a boss fight. Actually, I promise it will be the only other time I would do that. Like, look, two hits, I'm. three hits, I'm done. At full health. He's unelemental. He's interesting, to say the least. Uh, I did not get his chip, his life or chip, sadly, because that's what he carries, and I think it's because of the code I used. It made the game think I already had him. But that's the only chip you can get from him. By that, I have to S rank him, which is hell. Yellow, you never want to see charge. It's death. But, yeah, so... Something that I never knew at the time of recording this, but I did record the first little bit of it a minute, a couple minutes ago. Here's blue. It's simple, I'm just an idiot. Uh, uh, next up, I'm not ending the Battle Network series, Battle Network 1 just yet. But next up is going to be make, uh, Operation Shooting Star, which was the... DS remake crossover whatever of this game that only got released in Japan be and never got released up in North America sadly so yeah I'll be tackling that next and I'm gonna spoil it right here it's at least two parts so yes but th thank you all for watching the Battle Network series so far I hope you've all enjoyed as much as I have, and somehow just pulled like 10 bucks of change out of that small pocket, and you know how you have small pockets in your jeans? I'm sitting here trying to pull out all the money in it, and it's like 10 bucks in coins, and, and a couple toonies and doonies. That's kind of a funny. Yes, I'm probably going to duck out here just because I don't really think there's anything else I need to say because I thought this was the final episode when I record this I was saying my goodbyes but I'll save that for Operation Shoot and Stun. It's gonna be very likely me trying to explain the thought and playing completely blind that. Enjoy I'll see you all tomorrow for that and I will probably just take the rest of this week off after Operation Shoot and Start.
Thumbs up. Bye.